Welcome to Nanopedia. Hello, I'm Roberto Garcia. I'm a lab manager at the Analytical Instrumentation Facility at NC State University, part of the Research Triangle Nanotechnology Network. In this video, you will learn how to prepare a sample for an energy dispersive X-ray spectroscopy experiment or EDS experiment. Since we perform energy dispersive spectroscopy experiments in electron microscopes, preparation of a sample for EDS is the same as a sample preparation for SEM. Make sure you are wearing gloves. This is to protect the sample from getting contaminated by oils and dirt from your hands. The sample must be placed on a mount that is compatible with the SEM you are using to perform the experiment. In this case, we are going to attach our sample onto a Hitachi screw mount, which can fit into our Hitachi microscope. We will attach our sample to the mount using double-sided carbon tape. Double-sided tape is sticking on both sides, so we can attach it to the surface of the mount, then place the sample on the tape. Carbon tape is more conductive than regular tape and is better suited for electron microscopy because it allows transfer of the electrons from the beam into the sample. Cut a small square of tape off the roll. The size of the tape cut out needs to be smaller than the area of the mount, but big enough to securely hold the sample. Place the piece of tape on the mount. Make sure the tape is lying flat on the mount. Now remove the paper covering the top side of the tape. Using forceps, pick up the sample and carefully place it on the tape. Gently press down to make sure the sample adheres to the tape. If mounting an insulating sample, such as plastics and polymers, you may need to use a carbon coater to deposit a conductive layer onto the sample so it will be easier to generate an image. Since our sample is made of metal, we do not need to do this step. Now your sample is properly mounted and ready to be placed into the SEM for our EDS experiment.